what's going on people this is the Nexus one as you can see um, we're gonna go over the 2.2 update it's pretty cool it's got some cool things um, right here they changed they made it, they put a little bar here so you can do your dialing and whatnot and uh, you know your regular menu and then they added the browser to the bar so that's pretty cool um, oh, also now when you turn when you lock your phone it makes a noise Let's see if you can hear it I'll put a little closer so that's pretty cool too um what else is there all right uh some widgets let's see some new widgets added a analog clock is pretty cool take that out let's see um they have the home screen tips widget which is just basically six tips nothing really important stuff you already know but I mean it's cool if you're just learning how to use it alright and uh... let's see they got the market now you can see just random apps that pop up on the screen that's alright it's not really that useful but whatever um, what else is there? Oh, the new Google search. Let's see. Uh, Google search. There we go. Now you can pick if you want to search just for web or just apps or just contacts or all. Which I think is pretty cool. And then you just click on this little Google sign. And you could pick what you want to search for. If you want to search for apps, so that's pretty cool. Back breaker. Download that game. It's pretty awesome. All right, go back. All right. Um, that power bar. They changed the brightness settings on here, so now they have bright, really bright, and automatic. So that's pretty cool. Um, the car home. They changed that. Uh, I think it's okay. But I mean, it'll do. So, let me get out of there. Oh, and let's see. Let's go to settings. Some setting options here. Some new ones. Let's see. They got the tethering and the the hot uh, portable Wi-Fi hotspot it's pretty cool um let's see settings they have for this do, 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 do. okay let's see you could do some security security's cool keep you nice and safe and whatnot Um, let's see, oh, they have, they have some new lock screens, which I think are alright. So, um, let's see, they got the regular pattern, they got a pin, so now you can put in a pin. Let's see how that works. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. Um, let's see, they have another one. They have password where you can just put anything you want, basically. So let's put Q, 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 Q. Continue. Okay, confirm it. Q, 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 Q. Okay. And just put it in. You're good to go. I don't really like that one that much, but it's alright. Um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, applications. We go here now and go to manage. And now we have the SD setting, which is there's no apps available to put on your SD for right now. You have to get some updates for them. 
Um, let's see. The voice input is pretty cool. Let's check that out. Uh, it's under voice input. The voice recognition. Now you could change your safety search. Leave mine's on off. Um, block offensive words. You could turn that on or off. Eventually. Uh, keep mine's off anyways, you know. Curse a couple people out while I'm driving. Um, let's see. The calendar. Calendar's a little different. Not that different, but it's a little different. I don't really like this one. I like the old, I like the old one better, but it's what they did. Um, let's see what else. The text messaging. Not really loving that. Instead of having the bar across, it just has pictures and pictures and pictures. Um, it's not really that great. I like the bar before, and then you just click on it. But it's we'll still all do the same thing from the last update, which is all right. But they need to change this one back back to the old text messaging. Um, I mean, that's pretty much all the cool stuff for right now, so if I find anything else that's great, uh, let you guys know. Alright, peace.